Next night, keeping with the cost of living, pawnbrokers in Rotherham have been overwhelmed by people cashing in their council tax rebate checks. Now, many people couldn't wait for the £150 check to clear at a bank, so they've chosen instead to incur an administration cost at the cash shops instead. Now, the rebate was paid out to help with the cost of living crisis. Our reporter Mark Ansell takes up the story. When Natalie Bird received a £150 council tax rebate cheque from the government, which it's giving households in bands A to D, she desperately needed to put money on her electricity meter. Because it would have taken days for the cheque to clear in the bank, she joined the queues at pawn shops in Rotherham to get the money straight away. The pawnbroker took a £16 cut and it was a five-hour ordeal to get her money. The only time I've ever seen anything like what I saw on Tuesdays or like um, in newsreels from like 1980s dull queues and like a massive recession type things and and it's demoralising, it's kind of dehumanising. Um, yeah, it is, that's how I felt. Natalie does weekly litter picks in East Herringthorpe with councillor Michael Bennett Sylvester. Michael says the fact some people cannot afford to wait days for a cheque to clear through the bank is a symptom of a wider cost of living crisis. Oh, I was furious. Again, it just typifies the state of the country that we're in. And you've got people here having to walk to town to cash a cheque so she can have electric on that night. It's wrong and it, it, it just makes me furious. In a statement from the cash shop, it says, Unfortunately, banks refuse to offer this type of basic service to their customers and, moreover, put a hold on cheques for at least three days. Our unique cheque cashing service provides immediate cash to customers for which we take the inherent risk the cheques may not clear. Banks continue to marginalise many consumers and deprive them of essential financial services like cheque cashing. You know, £150 sounded so good on Tuesday and then when you realise that it doesn't go anywhere, that's scary because £150, I, I remember even just a few years ago, £150 would have lasted me a couple of weeks, whereas now it's, it's a month's worth of gas and electric. In a statement, Rotherham Council says making these payments within the criteria set by government has been extremely challenging for all councils. We know people are struggling, so our aim has been to get the money to them as quickly as possible. Mark Ansell, BBC Look North, Rotherham.